we'll start our inspection for uh, the Let's go back to the inside. Turn off the switch. Signal left. And the lights are on. Open the hood. Parking lights, signal lights are working. Number place is okay. With the pedal, there is no leak underneath the engine. Mirror is okay. Chest frame is okay. Springly, springly support, U bolt. Shock observer, spring leaf on the back, spring leaf support on the back are okay. Tire and rim from inside is okay. Check the tire from asphalt to asphalt. No nail. Outside wall is okay. The rim is okay. Lugners are okay. Wall is okay. There's no oil leak. Bumper and mirror is okay. Engine oil level is okay. Oh, sorry, power strain fluid level is okay. Engine oil was verified in the morning, it was okay. Power strain column is okay, box is okay, drag link, drag link is okay, chassis frame is okay, spring leaf, spring leaf support, U bolt, shock observer, spring leaf on the back, support on the back are okay, tire and rim inside is okay. Then check your tire from the asphalt. Asphalt all the way down. No nail. Outside wall is okay. Rim is okay. Lugners are okay. Wall is okay. No oil leak. Mirror is okay. Tire fixtures on the board. Open the latch. Three triangles are on the board. Door open and close is okay. Signal light is okay. All the parts are okay. Light is okay. Air hoses and electric cable is okay. Chassis frame, cross members are okay. Shoe cap and two straps are okay. There's no two leak. Springlish support is okay. Upper plate, fifth wheel is okay. Upper plate and fifth wheel is okay. Lock mechanism and pin is inside. If it's not, it's a major defect. Uh, sliding plate is okay. Sliding plate lock is inside. Nut ports are okay. We have to go inside. <coughs> On left side. Spring leaves are okay, spring leaves support and U boards are okay. Shock observer and air suspension is okay. Chassis frame is okay. The right side. Spring leaves, spring leaves support, U boards are okay. Chassis frame is okay. There's no object between the tires. Both sides. You have to check the tires. Check the tires. You have to simultaneously both sides. No nail, outside wall is okay, the rim is okay, then you have to check all the lugners, lugners are okay, wall is okay, second wall is okay, there's no oil leak. Cross members, cross members are okay, rail is okay, then rear tires, pressure is okay, check your tires, all the way down carefully, no nail. Outside wall is okay, the rim is okay, the lugners are okay, valve and second valve is okay, no oil leak. Chassis frame is okay, sorry, rail is okay, all clear sides are okay, chassis frame is okay, dolly leg is okay, we have very clear lock pin. King pin is inside, jaw is closed, 
fifth wheel is okay, chassis frame, cross members are okay, parking lights, signal light is okay, air suspension and air suspension support is okay, cross members are okay, trailer legs are okay, landing gear is okay, chassis frame is okay, cross members are okay, yeah. Road is properly secured. Signal light is okay. Chassis frame is okay. Cross members are okay. Load is properly secured. Uh, cross members are okay. Air suspension is okay. Swing arms are okay. Swing arm support is okay. Shock observers are okay, Excel is okay. Chassis frame is okay. Uh, uh, air suspension support is okay. Tire pressure is okay. Carefully, watch carefully, all the way down. No nails. Outside wall is okay. Rim is okay. Lug nuts are okay. Wall and second wall is okay. Oil level is okay, no oil leak. Yeah. Uh, pin is properly locked, chassis frame is okay, spring leash support is okay, oh sorry, air suspension support is okay, tire pressure is okay, check your tires, all the way down, no nail, outside wall is okay, rim is okay, lug nuts are okay, oil level is okay, Wall is okay, second wall is okay, no oil leak. In the back, reflector tape is okay, parking lights are okay, S signal light is working, wheels are parallel. Excuse me, sir, can you check my brake lights and uh, uh, signal light, please? wall is okay, rim is okay, lug nuts are okay, wall, second wall is okay, oil level is okay, no oil leak, uh, air suspension support is okay, chassis frame is okay, pin is properly locked, visible, check your tires, all the way down, no nail, pressure is okay, outside wall is okay, rim is okay, lug nuts are okay, Oil level is okay. Valve. Second wall is okay. Chassis frame is okay. Load is properly secured. Reflector tape is okay. Rail is okay. Rear side, signal light is okay. Chassis frame, cross members. Cross members are okay. Load is properly secured. Clear side, clear side, chassis frame, dual leg, check the pressure, check your tires, all the way down, no nail, outside wall is okay, rim is okay, lug nuts are okay, wall, second wall is okay, no air leak, no oil leak. Fifth wheel is okay, sliding plate is okay, lock is inside. No, uh, sorry, nut boards are okay, properly fixed. We have to go inside. The left side, spring leaf, spring leaf support, U bolt, 
Are okay, chest frame is okay on the right side. Air suspension, shock observer, springly, springly support, U-bolts are okay, chassis frame is okay, no object between the tires. Left side. Then we have to check again tires here, all the way down, no nail, our side wall is okay. Rim, lug nuts are okay, valve and second valve. Okay, no air leak, no oil leak. Spring support is okay, clear flight is okay. Chassis frame, motor support are okay. Fuel cap, two straps are okay, no fuel leak. Signal light is okay. Door open and close is okay. Close the hood. You see the top of the screen. Bring it here. And then close the hood. Please so start our inspection. Turn on the engine, turn off your signal, and for the lights. Okay, now the brakes are activated. We will, first, we will check the gas pedal. Gas pedal is working. Then release the brakes. Pump your brake, go at 98 PSI. That's it. Then we can activate that uh, fast idling. Open your window a little bit to listen push from our side. In the meantime, compressor is going towards 117, 137 PSI. We have to do inspection inside. My steering wheel. Not coming out from car. CT horn, highway horn is okay. Windshield, windshield washer is working. Wipers are working. If uh, driver side is not working, major passenger side minor. My seat and seat belt is working. There is no smell inside. Both windows are working. Foster is working. My compressor stopped. My compressor stopped. If my compressor does not stop in between 117 to 137 psi, it's minor. Then uh, we have to turn off the engine. Turn it on your switch. Wait for the gauges. Press your brake and listen outside by watching your needles. I couldn't hear any air leak. Needles are stable. If I lose four to six PSI, it's minor. Seven plus, it's major. Then start your engine. Pump your big, go at 80 PSI. Watch your needles. Compressor start building air. If compressor start building air 80 or under, it's minor. Then press your brake and hold. Needle went down a little bit. We have to wait until compressor reached at 90 psi. Okay, compressor, compressor reached at 90 psi. If compressor does not maintain or reach 90 psi, it's a major defect. Then check your lower pressure buzzer. Lower pressure devices are working. One is not working minor, two major. Then we can increase our RPM to build up a little bit air pressure to check that brake system. Now we'll 
check our brake system. We we'll apply second gear. Check your service brake. My service brake is working. If not, major. We'll check tra trailer brake. It's working. If not, minor. Tractor brake. If not working, it's minor. Release carefully. Both are, both brakes are released. Hand brake. Hand brake is working. If not minor, then we have to check wheel rotation from left side. My wheels are rotating. Then right side. My wheels are rotating. Not locked. My vehicle is in good position. We can go on the road.